Wild day on the boys' side. Century looking for an upset over Fargo Davies. We go to the final minutes of this one. Century leading by one. Ryan Erickson having a big night. Muscles in that shot for two. Pats lead by three. Now leading by two with half a minute to go. A missed jumper, but offensive boards were huge for Davies. Alex Proctor on the putback. We are going to overtime. That's when Davies ran away with it. An 8-0 run to start the extra frame. Raymond Brown for three in the corner. That would seal it for the Eagles. Century losing a heartbreaker, 84-72. This Mark Demons in a rematch with West Fargo from last year. In the first half, Demons grabbing the offensive board. Extra pass to Trayson Eaglestaff. You know what he's going to do next. Dangerous from three. Demons on the board. Who's West Fargo fast out of the gate? The defending champs in title form. Fode Sheriff from the corner. Building a double digit lead. On the other end, Bismarck looking to answer. Look at this neat little lay in from Carter Sims. But Bismarck could never stay with the Packers. 87 64. Another rematch from last year. Mandan and West Fargo Cheyenne. First half, Luke Darris. Off to a hot start, hitting a couple threes, including this one. A four point ball game at that point. But an offensive outburst by Cheyenne puts them up by 10 at the half, including this buzzer beater shot from Michael Nile. In the second half, it was more of the same for the Mustangs. Swinging into the corner, Nile leaking out for three. Got it. 29 on the night for him, and Mandan falls to the Mustangs in the quarterfinal, 61 48. Minot wins in a last second shot in overtime, 73 72. 